episode 73, when to be wary. What I mean about this, when you're a published author and you put your books out for sale, you become a public personality. And in the United States, as a public personality, that means people can say horrible things about you and make them up. And they're protected by the First Amendment because you're a public personality. So anyway, if you hide, if you uh, hide, if you uh, publish behind a pen name and you don't make your your real name and persona public, that's a different issue. Then you have gone to uh, lengths to keep your uh, identity secret, and that's cool. But just in case, <clears throat> you're you're now published, so now you're a target for people who are looking to take a cut of what you make, and that's where <clears throat> I say cold calls. If somebody's just cold calling you and offering services, that's an issue. That's now it's time to be wary because especially when you start making money, the worst uh, uh, experiences people have is when they're successful. Failure and success are the two extremes that shape you and will warp you and will cause problems for you. So extreme failure, well, hey, uh, where do you go? Uh, you're lost. You're, you're trying to claw your way up the, the mountain to take care of yourself and your family. And extreme success, now you've got the dogs nipping at your heels trying to take advantage, uh, get a cut of the pie as it may be, take credit for your success, all of those things. So cold calls, no matter from whom, those are that's a time to be wary, especially if they're... <clears throat> Uh, contacts from people who say, ah, I can boost your sales. I, I like it when Mark Dawson posts uh, from somebody who cold called him and sent him an email saying, hey, we can boost your sales 10%. And it's like, hey, do you know what my sales are? 10% is a big number. Can you really, can you really do that? So uh, uh, this is people just spamming you awards. Hey, you're, you're up for this award. Join us, pay us 50 bucks. And uh, yeah, no, because <clears throat> uh, take a look, look deeper. If it's gonna be you paying them, yeah, you wanna be wary. Fans who are over exuberant, and this is something that uh, uh, I saw this morning, uh, uh, LJ Ross, probably one of the most successful indie authors in the history of indie authordom. Uh, somebody dropped her a note through her mail slot asking for uh, a, a book and uh, or, or looking to buy books. And it's uh, that's creepy as fuck. So uh, you, you might wanna, <laughs> that's, that's something you really need to be wary of. Uh, where I live, it's not hard to find my my real physical address, but I live so far out away from the rest of humanity that uh, uh, most people can't get here. And those that can, <clears throat> I live in a private neighborhood where nobody casually drives because there's nothing here except people who who are supposed to be here. And, and then to get to my house, it's even worse than that. So people don't casually show up here and I don't want them to show up here. I'll chase them off with a shotgun. Uh, even if they're family, uh, no, don't come and visit us. Uh, go away. <clears throat> uh, contact from people, uh, let's say direct messages through social media. This is something to take care of, especially with the new Facebook. You might get a message that looks like, oh, geez, it's from somebody I know. <clears throat> it goes into your normal feed and you find out that no, as soon as you answer it, now you're friends. So you want to be wary, wary of direct messages, uh, read the content, Maybe take a look at who the person is if their if their uh, uh, profile's locked down. Uh, you need to understand who you're talking with, and that goes for everything. Whether it's a business, whether it's a uh, a foreign rights. Hey, send us a PDF, and we'll uh, look at publishing your foreign rights. This is a significant question because that's kind of how it works. So uh, you have to take a very very close look at uh, foreign rights to see if the 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 company is indeed legitimate and the address, the email address is indeed legitimate uh, because that's how they do business. They, they want PDFs and uh, yeah, you think, well, just buy the EPUB and, and read it there. But now it's, it's, it's weird. So uh, that's one where you have to take a close look uh, at address. I, I have a PO box for my, for my newsletter and I use a PO box for most of my stuff. It's down the road and it actually is much more convenient than the, the box out on the road a quarter mile from where I live. <clears throat> so that's how I I, I I separate. Here's my home. Here's me, and here's my stuff. So uh, if you, if you want to send me stuff, and actually I've gotten a bunch of stuff, and Amazon has uh, not included gift cards, saying here's who it's from. So I have a bunch of stuff. I should probably take pictures and post it and say, hey, who sent this? I appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, I'd like to send you a personal thank you, but I don't know who you are. <clears throat> that's cool. Here's my PO box. Have a nice day. Uh, 
Uh, and it's nice to get that kind of stuff. Hey, here's something I just thought you'd like it. You're always talking about coffee. Here's a little coffee. Here's popcorn. Here's here's cookies. Uh, that that stuff is kind of cool. Somebody made me a Mac inspired by one of my series and actually just got a, a, a song. A guy wrote a song based on one of the characters in my book. So I, I'll share that on my, uh, my website later. Cause that's, and that's really cool. That's cool stuff. That's where you're being a public personality. You're an author. That's the cool stuff, but Hey, I want to come play it for you in the living room. Dude, dude, come on, hold that off. So be wary, especially success means be more wary. It doesn't mean be a dick to people because that's something you don't want to do. That's uh, take care of yourself and 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 uh, make sure your soul isn't crying out in pain because uh, now your personality has changed. Success is what will reveal your real personality. So the more successful you are, you still be kind. You can still be uh, uh, tactful. There's no need to just shut people down. People are going to disappoint you, especially the more successful you are because they're going to try to sneak in and they want something from you. Be careful. Be wary. Anyway, that's it. My five minute focuses are getting longer. Uh, I'm uh, rambling. Peace, fellow human.